the InCal remediation treatment process. InCal was recently demonstrated in Edmonton, Alberta to a group of oil producers, environmentalists, and financiers. In this demonstration, drill cuttings, a mixture of fine sand and drill fluids, were processed in the prototype unit. The contaminated drill cuttings are converted to fine dry soil and light hydrocarbon fluids. The soil meets the Alberta Tier 1 criteria and the hydrocarbons are reusable without any further processing. Here's how it works. The unit is brought up to an optimum operating temperature. The contaminants are fed into the hopper located at the top of the unit. The mixture is moved through a multi-pass conveyor section where it is heated to temperatures of up to 1000 degrees Fahrenheit. The heat is supplied by electrically heated thermal blankets that run along the conveyors. There is very little heat loss from the unit. The combination of multi-pass conveyors and a controllable heat source and feed rate allows the in-cal process to be applied to many applications. The hydrocarbons are liberated by the heating process and the resulting vapors are drawn off, cooled and condensed. To complete the process, the dry treated soil is fed to a collection vessel. The treated soil can then be disposed of safely in the environment. Key features of the in-cal remediation process are InCal has the ability to treat a variety of contaminated material. InCal can be taken directly to the source of contamination and is suited to both offshore and onshore applications. InCal can be outfitted with automated feed and collection units which can be custom tailored to handle various source material.